Well, here we see the spacecraft with uh, the TGO with the EDM mounted on top already and it's being brought into, into the horizontal position because that's the way Russian launches work. Everything's integrated horizontally. In Western rockets, it's vertically and it's much more complicated, but of course, it's, it's kinder on the payload. And uh, here you have to be careful, you have to change it from 90 degrees to zero degrees and then move it in. Here you see one half of the fairing coming in. It's integrated already, the lower half of the fairing that will protect the payload during the ascent from the thermal and load and the, the, the drag forces of the atmosphere. Here it's being closed and here it's on a, on a train. So, yeah, it's transported from the integration facility to the launch pad by, by train, of course, very slowly, very carefully. And uh, you can see that uh, there's a kind of hood on the, on the fairing with pipes going in and out, and that's air conditioning. So you have a controlled environment uh, underneath the fairing all the time. Okay, they're all really, really very careful. Uh, to lift it now. I think they're raising it now. Yes, now yeah. it has to, well, now finally it has to be brought to the upright position. So and uh, it will stand there, it's just freestanding, it's not uh, clamped down or anything. So it, this was on, the, on Friday and uh, today it was the lower three stages were filled with uh, 620 tons of propellant. The upper stage, the fourth stage, the breeze had already been filled before it was integrated.